welcome to my channel thank you for joining me today today i am back with a shopping haul i've been to home bargains poundland and b&m although i did only get one thing from b&m which is what i'm going to start with and it was this pack of two tea towels and i just think they are so pretty so they're like cream color they've got lovely braiding along the, the bottom and um, the second one's just got hasn't got the scene on it's just got the the braiding along and that one has got the lovely winter scene on there with the christmas trees and the stags but guys you know what i feel like it's too soon for christmas and i am mrs christmas through and through love christmas um but i like christmas once halloween is out of the way i like to concentrate on halloween and autumn and then from the 31st of october the very next day i think right i'm in christmas mode now and i want to look, start looking at christmas stuff um, but I've been to the range, I've been to Home Bargains and I've been to, where else was it? Been and Bargains and they've literally got the full on Christmas range out um, and it's kind of just too soon. I should sit here holding our Christmas tea towels. Um, but no, the reason I bought these was because I think they'll go really quickly. I just thought they were so pretty um, and I can just imagine them sort of sitting over my cooker, the handle on my oven. Um, clearly not to be used just for sure, of course. I don't want spaghetti bolognese on them. Um, but yeah, so I picked up those. Then I went to Home Bargains and I got some storage containers. I just got these little tin foil ones, they were the only ones I could get actually. I did want the plastic ones from Poundland but they don't seem to be doing them anymore. Um, so I got these ones and they're just medium foil trays and I kind of want to say they were 89 pence for 12. Um, I'm going to do some batch cooking and I thought I could do like a pan of chilli, spaghetti bolognese and curry and it just means whilst we don't have a kitchen we've always got something to sort of throw in the microwave um, straight from the, well not straight from the freezer because they're in tin foil um, but yeah we could just, it saves us from having just to eat on speed dial I suppose when we're doing the kitchen so I got two packs of those I also picked up some of this floral foam and the reason that I got that was because autumn winter coming up and I know I'll be doing some sort of floral display um, and I just thought I would have it in and it is cheapest chips in home bargains at again I want to say 89 or 99p um, so I got one of those. I also picked up two of these reusable takeaway mugs. And they've just got like the little drink hole in the top and these are made from single oh right it just says 50 percent bamboo and 50 percent polypropylene so i guess plastic is polypropylene plastic it kind of sounds like it doesn't it um and they've got like the heat protectors on them as well and just when i go to work i always take a nice coffee with us and a my glass jar which isn't really safe is it when i'm driving so i just thought these would be better and they're a better size as well so i got two of those and again i would like to say those were like 79 pence or 89 pence i know they were very cheap so i got two of those and then a nice sort of neutral tone then i got some of these pajamas slash loungewear from home bargains and they were only £12 and they're a lovely soft knit they're like an oatmeal colour sort of taupey colour they've got pockets in the sides they've got I would say maybe straight legs I would say boot cut actually boot cut leg nice and sort of floppy very soft material they've got like a ribbed waistband elastic and the top is like a jumper top did I say they were from the Jeff Banks range? And they were only £12, which is like Primark prices, if not maybe a little bit cheaper. They've got like on the side of the pyjamas, so they're just long sleeved, like a jumper, crew neck, round neck, and they've got a little gather detail on the side. And they are quite spacious. I would imagine they're oversized. I got the 18 to 20. I would have gotten the 20 to 22 if they had them, but they didn't. So I got the 18 to 20, but it's kind of fits. It could do with being a little bit more roomy, but it's actually okay and they're very wearable. And I just thought they're just nice and snuggly and they're soft. And it's sort of like what I would wear on a Sunday if I wasn't going out. Just to sort of sit around all day, nice and comfy. Um, but you still feel sort of like dressed enough. If somebody knocks on the door, it doesn't look like you're like in your nightwear. Um, so I got those. 
I also at the tail picked up two of these and these were reduced to 50p and I don't know if they're close to date the 18th of the 12th so no they're all right um and they are in the honeycomb and nut flavor and like i say they're only 50p a bar so i just picked up two of those and then popped over to poundland and again it's kind of kitchen related stuff but I thought these were these little dishes were cheap enough to replace. So as I've been emptying everything out over the years, over the last 30 years, I've collected like loads of odd, like odd bowls and things that just don't match. And I thought, you know, I went into Poundland and it's cheap enough to have everything matching. Those were like a pound each. And I thought they're so nice to bake like an individual little pie or um I don't know put chili in there just whatever you want so i got three of those for a pound each and they've got the little lids could even put soup in them or whatever and i love the fact that they were just neutral tones they were very sort of clean and white now i don't know if you can put them in the microwave or the dishwasher and i can't even tell you because i haven't got my glasses on and i can't see and these days my arms aren't even long enough for us to see at a distance all right, they can go up the they can go in the oven to two hundred degrees, or two hundred C Celsius. So yeah, um, so I've got three of those because the three of us live in the house, and I just thought if I'd done like individual little pies or shepherd shepherd's pie or cottage pie or whatever. So I've got three of those, and then I got three of these ones which were also a pound each. And I thought they would be great if I'd done like individual lasagnas or something like that. And like I say, it's just cheap enough to have everything matching. Everything in my kitchen is odd that I've just collected over the years. Um, so I've got three of those. Oh, I've got the receipt here as well. I would like to say this one was £3. Then I've got a large sort of dish if I was doing... I would say a lasagna as well or a pasta bake or something like that and that was three pound and then i got the larger one which is like a casserole dish and this one was five pounds with a lid on as well um so yeah so that can go in the obviously it's oven proof but like I can't tell you if it's microwave friendly. I don't know. Anyway, so the whole lot come to like fourteen pound, and I just thought I can get rid of all of the odds and sods in the kitchen and have everything matching, and it'll just look nice and tidy. Um, starting starting new, starting fresh, and I'll just get rid of all of my old odds and sods that are cracked in. Just don't look very nice anymore. Um, yeah. So that was that. So now I'm going to move on to my giveaway. So as I said, every time I hit a milestone on my YouTube journey, I was going to do a little giveaway. And I, I know I've just done the giveaway, which was the glass pumpkin. But then that weekend, I hit 3,000 subscribers. But because the glass pumpkin went down so well, I thought, you know, I'm going to do another giveaway of a, a glass pumpkin. So I went, when I was in Home Bargains in Biker, so if anybody lives in the northeast and they live around the Biker area, Home Bargains literally had loads and loads of these glass pumpkins and I know a lot of you guys said you just cannot get a hold of them at all in your home bargains so I thought you know I'm going to do another pumpkin giveaway they're only $3.99 and I know that lots of people are after them so I picked up another one of these so if you would like to be entered into the giveaway again all you've got to do is just comment down below and as long as you're subscribed to my channel you'll be in with a chance and I'm going to let that run until roughly about Sunday the 26th. Um, so that's not Sunday coming, the Sunday after. Um, so like I say, just all you've got to do is just leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. And um, I'll do that draw live on the Sunday. So that brings me to the end of my video. I really do hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like and subscribe. And hopefully I will see you in my next video.